Good morning. Sunrise. Oh, what's that? Oh. That's the moon. Um, crazy. Just a couple days ago was the super blue, blue super moon. Um, and now it's just a, quite a bit of it is gone. Um, neat. Um, congratulations, you guys get the moon this morning. I'm out here watching the sunrise. It's, it's taking its time and uh, there aren't very many clouds. I mean, there aren't any clouds except for way over on the horizon. Small little bit of straight line clouds over there doing whatever they're going to do. But we need to see what that does to the sunrise this morning. Uh, it is a it's a beautiful morning. I slept in a little bit. I slept in a little bit. Um, <clears throat> but because the sun's coming up later, I should still get out here and catch the show. So I got my coffee right there. I'm at the park. <clears throat> I'm just leaning on this post. There's, there's a few people out and about. Um, <clears throat> it is a, it is a, it is cooler this morning. It's 64 degrees. And it's funny how perceptions change. <clears throat> it's funny how perceptions change. Uh, because the 64 used to be warm. And now it's cooler. But, you know, if it was 64 during the day, I'd say it's a great day to eat outside. But I can't get that yet. We're not there yet. In a couple more months. Um, <clears throat> so, yeah. I'm just out here enjoying my sunrise. Watching what little there is of the world go by um, at this hour there's a guy walking his dog there was a runner and there was another person walking around there are a few cars in the parking lot i just don't know where everybody's at so anyways i'm gonna get back to this and i'll see you guys in a little while I'm not the only one up early this morning is he yeah, he's moved on but all right let's see this And if I do that, it looks, well, there you go, he's back. The guy's working away. He's out there getting, getting his breakfast for his friends. But, uh, that's happening. That's fun times. Right. Back in a bit. Look at this. If I get out of the way, yeah. pretty good uh, that was the actual sun in the trees there i can just see it there's enough tree hiding it that i can look right at the sun don't stare at the sun that's bad um but i was thinking about that bee that i just showed you and i learned an interesting fact this week at work um there's a lot of trivia that happens at work and if anybody were to just observe any random part of the day, you wouldn't think that we actually do anything in that office other than trivia. But I learned that bees have five eyeballs. Five eyes. Two compound eyes on the sides and then three right in their forehead that are used for navigation. That's pretty interesting, right? And then another bee fact that I learned a while back is that Bees don't waste their time telling flies that honey tastes better than shit. Um, so that's a good life lesson for you to take with you wherever you go. Uh, don't waste your breath telling an idiot that what you got's better than what they got. Um, but anyway, so that's, I just wanted to share that, that first bee tidbit. Uh, the other one is a sticky note on my monitor to remind me to remind myself um yeah i'm just gonna keep walking enjoying this enjoying that thing um, it's a good day for it uh, and, then, and the bugs aren't the bugs aren't awake yet which is good other than that guy that one guy but 
it usually takes 0 0.3 seconds for my ankles to get chewed up out here. Um, but they're, it, they're, they're leaving me alone right now, so I'm going to enjoy this walk and get myself a few steps in. And then uh, I'll see you guys in a bit. That's a panicled dogwood. Not panicked, panicled. They're all in fruit right now. We're going to talk about something else. We'll see if I can find it and it'll remind me. All right, back later. This is a panicking oak. It's related to the white oak. And what I saw about it, it has an interesting leaf for an oak leaf, you know, it's not what you, you know, it's, it's not what you think of when you think of oak leaves. Um, it's, it's in the white oak family and it supposedly has the tastiest acorns, um, <clears throat> which are prized both by animals and humans. Um, I thought that was interesting because acorns you know, a lot of tannins that I'm in. Those are supposed to be sweet. I don't know if that means they're sweet after you soak the tannins out of them or if you just eat them right off of the ground. That was that, was that thought. Um, anyways, more later. See you in a bit. Look at this goldenrod just on fire here. It's the only... I mean, there's this one. But... The only thing flowering next to this pond, up this path, the only flowers. Interesting. It's pretty. The goldenrod's got this team. The flowers are just itty bitty. They almost look like um, come on, focus on that. They're just teeny tiny. Um, it just almost looks like it's been dusted with pollen, the whole plant, but those are the little flowers. Um, pretty. Okay, more later. Um, I was about to make an attempt into the woods, but then um, and I'm not going to disturb this one because he's doing real well. And he's, but uh, can I reach around here without looking at him? That's not him. Nope, that's a tickling of him. Um, See? Big guy. You got a big web. That thing's probably 18 inches across. But I'm gonna I'm just gonna let him be. Um and take that as a sign of what else is to come by going into the woods. So I'm just gonna mind myself in the little field out here and keep looking at other things. Uh, it's not time to go in the woods yet, so I'll be back. All right, I just checked the farmer's market off my list. It's not very big. It only took me not even 10 minutes to walk the whole thing. Um, it is bigger than the farmer's market I had in Magnolia by quite a bit, probably three times larger. Um, but there was just not not a lot of producers. There were a lot of crafts and there's food trucks. Um, there was honey in there. There was a guy with some honey and I should have looked at his honey, but I didn't. I don't need honey. Um, so yeah, that's done. On to the next thing. Ta-da! Check. Laundry. Check. Mulch. And that's that's probably where I'm going to leave it today. I'm going to end this video because I don't know how long it is. Because I did talk to you this morning and I did things. So I have no idea how long this is going to be. So hope you guys are having a good day. Hope you're doing well and feeling healthy today. Hope uh, you guys got some good weather where you're at. You can get out, garden, wash truck, catch the sunset whatever it is maybe see the sunrise tomorrow i don't know anyways i love you guys and i will see you tomorrow <laughs>